Okay, today we're going to be doing an allodermal graft on number 27 and 28. You can see the 27 and 28 just have the occlusal margins. This one appears to be a little bit keratinized and it's broken right here. And then this one is definitely just all mucosa. Doesn't have any pocketing. Um, we're going to try to get root coverage as well as a uh, thicker and more stable result. Okay, so here's our alloderm, and this alloderm is a one by one piece. You can see that here's one. That's one by one right there. So with alloderm, you do get a lot more. Um, we used to get one by two pieces. We still get one by two pieces, but. Um, this one by one piece is going to be enough for both of those teeth and, um, and more. So we're using these little tiny serrated scissors for this. Because alloderm is typically not real easy to cut, but it's much easier with these scissors. So we got our graft fashioned, and we're going to be placing that in. Turn a little bit to the left. You can see a procedure just like this, though, on YouTube. Um, I've got several of them on there. Y yes. When you, uh, a year or so ago, you had mentioned to Andrew, and he showed, my memory is that he showed me that it was there, but at the time I didn't take the time to watch it. Oh, yeah, well, they're still there. So you get to watch it live. Which is absolutely wonderful. You okay? I've now had um, 580,000 views of my videos on YouTube. The things that we're doing, that's for sure. I mean, some of the, for, certainly some of the surgeons that, that present and things are just brilliant. They're incredible. But it's been interesting. You know, I watched that stuff and I think, oh, you know, the things that we're doing are far less invasive, much quicker. And people, you know, I don't, I, I don't need to wait to go present at a meeting to get it, to get these techniques out all over the world. Yeah. Uh, they're just already there. Actually, I yeah, sent one video to a friend of mine who's a, an incredible woman. She's, she helped me do some of my original research. Um, okay. 
and so I just sent her a link to one of my videos and asked and then told her about my YouTube channel and uh, recommended that she share that with some of their grad students. Yes. The perio and the pros and the um, and the oral surgery grad students. So we'll see. You so know. that was recently that you sent that? Yeah, that was yesterday. Because she needs to know. She's, this, this woman was a dental assistant to a guy who was like one of the mo most legendary periodontists You're gonna come ever. Me. Then she became a hygienist and she became his hygienist. Yeah. Then she went to dental school, became a dentist. Then went to perio and uh, became a periodontist. Then she was really into research and became, um, after that, ended up becoming the chairman of the, the postdoctoral program in periodontics at a University of Louisville. And then she became Yeah, that's our final suturing. We'll take a look at things in a couple weeks. The root coverage looks really good. Okay, this is a close to the two-month healing of the um, graft we did on the lower right. 